hello everyone in this video i'm going to show you how to create these motif repeat patterns in the app ibs paint text so first i'm going to open a one is to one 2k ratio canvas in the app ibs paint text and here i'm importing the color palette that i'm going to use so first i'm using this blue color using the eyedrop tool and i'm using the laser fill tool from the special tool and here i'm using the mirror ruler to create the symmetrical design so if I draw in one side it's going to be um, repeat or reflect on the other side like a mirror so that's the mirror ruler and here I'm just creating some random motif design to create this repeat pattern so you can you may have seen this kind of uh, patterns in clothes especially Indian clothes indigo patterns and uh, traditional kurta and all those such kind of dress so i'm just creating just a basic design uh, the main thing here is i'm going to tell you in detail the technique i'm going to use to create such a uh, complicated pattern especially when it comes to ibs paint text because there is no uh, particular tile option or anything uh, available here to make repeat pattern more uh, you know easy so we have to use the basic tools and uh, you know using uh, the basic tools we have to think and do this kind of complicated repeat pattern because if you have only one element in the entire canvas it is very easy to repeat uh, the uh, element into the entire pattern but when you have more elements uh, as especially if you want to create some uh, repeat details at the corners of the uh, design or the canvas it is very difficult because this is going to be cropped when you create the repeat pattern because the design is not going to repeat there is no tile option that we can make use of in this so in such case how to create such a repeat pattern that's the main thing that i'm going to tell you here so i created the basic design using the laser fill tool it's very easy tool to create the shapes compared to the brush so now it's ready just i'm going to switch off the mirror ruler and then i'm going to duplicate this design two times so one this this at the bottom is going to be a reference i'm not going to use it i'm going to use the other two so in one layer if i just switch on the repeat and do this you can see it doesn't come out well so i will show you what the technique we have to use just move this design to the corner i'm in the second layer so i'm just moving the design to one corner and making it to the bottom or top whatever but it should be at the corner so once you're done click on the repeat option you can see it repeated by itself at all the corners also uh, there is no uh, shapes designed uh, cropped in this way so it is very easy to make them arrive at the corner for you so in the another layer the design is big it's like messing up with the other uh, design so i just made it smaller and i want to create some more details here so i just duplicated this layer and made it small and i'm going to place it here so this is another layer so don't worry about this make it small now i feel it's okay now i'm going to duplicate this and i'm making it to come at this side just by using the flip it horizontal option then i'm duplicating the layer once again and moving it to the bottom space available so make sure you position it exactly or you know approximately or uh, 99 percentage at the center to the other designs so like this and now i'm just merged everything and reduce the opacity of the layer like this so now it looks perfect now i just created a folder for all this to group it and now everything inside this folder now just click on the 
repeat option in the transform tool just keeping on the folder itself don't choose any particular layer instead choose the folder then drag and create pattern like this it's very simple i know but you have to uh, make sure you do perfectly while repeating the layers that i have told you before so this is how you can create the layer uh, i mean the pattern and if you want to add some background colors it's very simple if you want to keep it is it as white you can keep it as white and save as jpg or if you want to add some color just create a layer below that pattern and choose the color you want i'm just trying out with different colors and testing which color you uh, looks better results so you can see the with the white it gives good result and for, with the red the still the pattern is bright but it's uh, com uh, okay compared to the other colors also i'm going to try some navy blue color which make the design uh, which make the pattern as an indigo pattern so this also looks perfect so i uh, like all this and now i'm going to save this one by one as save is jpg just by selecting the layer and adding all the layers also with the uh, without any background color and here is the final pattern that i have created this is the one is to one ratio pattern so here if i zoom it we'll get the pattern like this and i hope you like this tutorial also the pattern so if you like this and my uh, tutorial please subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching